The Range Rover is the second-generation Range Rover model from British carmaker Land Rover. It was launched on September 28, 1994, 24 years after the introduction of the first-generation Range Rover. It included an updated version of the Rover V8 engine, with the option of a 2.5-liter BMW 6-cylinder turbo diesel. The new model offered more equipment and premium trims, positioning the vehicle above the Land Rover Discovery to face the increased competition in the SUV marketplace. It is usually known as the Range Rover P38 or P38A outside of Land Rover, after the factory building in which the production line was based. During the development stage the vehicle was known by its project designation of Pegasus and during production Land Rover referred to it as either the new Range Rover or by its model designation of LP. Specifications equals Engine equals, In 1999 the Range Rover V8 received a new Bosch engine management system from the BMW 7 Series. This replaced the Lucas Gems system. The diesel edition received an EGR system, which came with a plastic inlet manifold. A modulator sends back part of the exhaust gas into the manifold, thus mixing hot exhaust gas via a vacuum pump into the cold air from the intercooler. Equals suspension equals, the second generation incorporated new engine management and improved electronic air suspension that allowed automatic, speed-determined height adjustment. The five suspension heights offered by EAS are access, highway, standard off-road, and off-road extended. Height was also adjustable manually between the first four settings. The off-road extended setting was only accessible automatically by the EAS ECU. Equals transmission equals, the 4.0L V8 petrol and the 2.5L I6 diesel engine were mated to either the R380 manual gearbox or the ZF4 horsepower 22 automatic gearbox, as used in the late classic Range Rover. 300 TDI, TD5 or V8 discoveries. The 4.6 L V8 petrol engine was only mated to the ZF4 horsepower 24 automatic gearbox. The R380 gearbox is basically the same as in the previous Range Rover, or Discovery 300 TDI. The primary shaft for the diesel is different with a small input diameter for the spigot bearing inside the BMW flywheel and the output shaft has been changed to allow for the different Borg Warner box. The Borg Warner transfer box no longer had direct control of high low range gears meaning that the vehicle has to nearly stop before shifting from high to low range and the lever from the classic model has been replaced by an electric control on the dashboard for the manual and an H pattern gate on the automatic gear lever. The transfer case's chain and sprockets have been reinforced. The rear differential on the 4.6L V8 petrol model were a four-pin version and four-wheel traction control was included with the vehicle, whereas initially the 4.0L V8 and the 2.5L I6 only had two-pin versions and two-wheel traction control on the rear wheels only. Later versions had the four-wheel traction control and the later 4.6L V8 petrol model had a four-pin front differential. Equals chassis equals, the chassis was also made stronger and new welding techniques were used. This was the last Range Rover available with a manual gearbox and a classic transfer box. Other features included anti-lock braking system and in some automatic gearbox models two-wheel traction control a Euro although later models saw this feature applied to all four wheels. References External links HTTP www.register.co.uk slash CVC Register, a club of enthusiasts who research and restore pre-production, press launch and factory owned P38 Range Rovers. Media related to Land Rover Range Rover at Wikimedia Commons.